I have just completed an experiment and I'd like to share the results with you because I think you might find it useful. You see, I'd heard that cat litter, the crystal cat litter, in this case Bob Martin Felite, may actually be made of silica gel. And as such, some people are using it as a desiccant in the same way as the silica gel beads. So to test this, I got some of these modules. Now, these are actually dehumidifier modules that are rechargeable in the sense you can dry it out by blowing hot air in. And they're normally filled with the silica gel beads. But I emptied one out and I filled it with the Bob Martin Felite crystal cat litter. And then I put both units on this device. Now, these do have this cone up the middle, a perforated cone. And when hot air is blown up, it diffuses through the silica gel and it blows out the sides. And it basically heats it up and it drives the moisture out. So what I did was I sat the module on and I ran it for a while and then I took it off and weighed it and every so often uh, I'd do that until the weight uh, stopped reducing and at that point I knew that it was completely dry or as dry as this unit was going to get it. Then I just left the units and every few days I'd weigh them and log the weight and as soon as the weight stopped increasing, that's it, absorbing the moisture, then I did the mathematical computations and here are the results. So let's put this stuff out the way. Bring the results in. Focus down onto the results and zoom in a little bit. So, the dry weight of the silica gel, the beads in those cartridges was 337 grams or 11.9 ounces. The cat litter crystals are much, much lighter. They must be a porous structure, maybe so they can absorb the liquids. And uh, compared to 337 grams, I was only able to fit 165 grams or 5.8 ounces into the cartridge. Once I'd absorbed the weight, all the water from the air that it could, uh, the weight had gone up to 427 grams, the beads, or 15 ounces. And for the crystals, it had gone up to 94 grams or 6.8 ounces. That means the water absorbed by each of those cartridges was 90 grams, that's 90 millilitres, which is really impressive, or 3.2 ounces. Um, and for the crystals, it was about a third that, at 29 grams or 1 ounce. When you compute it, volume for volume as opposed to, well, weight for weight as opposed to the volume, then for 100 grams of crystals, and keep in mind that would be significant, this would be about twice the bulk of the beads. But for 100 grams or 3.5 ounces, it will absorb typically 20, 27 grams or 1 ounce of liquid from the air, or the crystals will absorb 18 grams or 0.6 ounce of water from the air. So it's about half as effective and much bulkier. So I'm guessing that's probably why the retail packages, when you get something with the little silica gel packages in it, I'm guessing that's ultimately why they tend to just use the round bead silica gel as opposed to crystals like this. But it was well worth doing. And that short answer is it's bulkier and it absorbs less water, but it does actually work just not as well.